springtime is the best time to go outside and blow some bubbles. Now you could go to the store and buy some of your own bubble solution, but why not make your own? So to do it, very simple. All you need is water, dish soap, Dawn is always a favorite, and we like to add a little something extra and special. That's glycerin right here. It's a little expensive, so you don't always have to use it, but it does add a nice touch to your bubble solution and makes it a lot stronger. So when we're making a bubble solution, you always wanna add the water first so that you're not creating massive foam. Now that you've got your water in, you want about two parts of water to one part of your Dawn or your dish soap. And then you take your glycerin and you just do about a squirt or so. Mix it up. Now, there's another element that you need for your recipe, or that at least helps, and that's time. You wait and wait and wait for about 24 hours. That's when you get your best solution. I created a nice big batch of bubble solution. I used about a gallon and a half, two gallons of water, and I put in about a fourth of a cup of our Dawn dish soap and about two tablespoons of our glycerin. We're gonna play with the shape. So I've created a cube. All you have to do to make a cube like this, it's really simple. You start with six pieces of pipe cleaner that you cut in half and six straws that you cut in half. You take your pipe cleaner, three pieces, and you twist them together. You're creating kind of like a pyramid. You're going to do the same thing with the rest of your pipe cleaners. So you'll have four different sets like this. You slide your straws on each piece of the pipe cleaner. And once you have all four sets, started, you're going to start twisting them together until you get your cube shape. Mine's a little wonky, but it still works. Try and make it as straight as you possibly can. Now I've got my cube. I'm going to go ahead and set it in my bubble solution. You pull out the cube. Now, because I'm having a difficulty with my shape, it's not perfect cube, but look, can you see? We've actually created a new shape inside. Now, for the biggest feat of all, could we create a bubble inside our bubble? <laughs> I finally got it in. So, it's not the prettiest, but it's there. We got our bubble inside a bubble. What can you do with a little bit of creativity, imagination, and lots of patience? Could you shake hands in a bubble? Could you stand inside a bubble? Could you make more bubbles inside a bubble? Go outside, have some fun, grab friends, and just play with the world of bubbles all around you.